happy Thursday. I have like <laughs> overly slept in. Um, well, not really. My alarm went off like 10 minutes ago. Let's get dressed. I'm going to get ready for work. Um, and then I'll check back in probably like just before I leave if I'm not running super late. Um, but yeah. I have to check the weather because I don't even know what the weather's going to be today. Definitely cold. Just finished getting ready. And I'm actually like making it on kind of good time. Um, oops. So I'm just going to brush my teeth. Get Harvey settled, pack my bags, and then leave for work. Um, I'm actually taking my Kindle to work. I do this when my um, bestie isn't at work because at lunchtime, like I go for a walk and then I come back and I've still got like 15 minutes of my lunch break left. So I'm gonna read more of this. I'm reading The Spare Room. It's actually not too bad so far. It's a bit like, you know, cringe. I'm coming off the back of Iron Flame as well. So like a bit of a, um, bit of a switcheroo but i just needed something like light to read and i thought something like that was kind of like it seemed a bit easier to read as well so that's what i'm currently reading um yeah i literally can't wait for today to be over because it's friday um so i've got like a pretty like quiet weekend but also like we've got stuff on so like we haven't really been doing much the past couple weekends which i'm not mad about because i love staying in plus like you know poor you know <laughs> okay quickly before i leave this is my outfit so a bit of a change from the black jacket i've been rinsing um so the pants are still glass and so i still need to dust my mirror so badly um the bomber is from lioness but i got it off glue it's like 40 percent off so i quickly like snatched that up because i love the dark denim like i was all about the leather like bombers that everyone was wearing but then i saw this and it's like a quilted i don't know if you can tell like quilted look dark denim bomber it just tucks up really nicely um and then these pants are still the glasses pants with my little ballet flats from the iconic this is weird I'm at work now. Um, just made a coffee and heated up my egg McMuffin. McMuffin? Egg muffin. Now I'm just gonna eat this. No one's really here yet, so. It's a bit quiet, so it's a bit creepy here when no one's here. Um, but yeah. to check my emails pop on like a podcast or something while it's still relatively quiet and get to work i'll check in a bit later okay so i got home a bit later than usual so i'm back in the same spot that you guys saw me this morning um but i'm about to have a shower it's going to be like a full shower i'm going to try not to take that long because well i'm not going to wash my hair um, I'm going to try and not take that long because I've got dinner in the oven. I just quickly made up the mixture for like a chicken pie. Then I've popped that in the oven um, to bake. And we're just having like some leftover cauliflower bake as well with that that we had last night too. And some little potato gems. I mean, not the healthiest, but like, you know, it's been raining and like, you know, shit weather. It's winter. It's a bit of a hearty meal and with gravy as well. We might also try the new banana stuff from Mac is like the Despicable Me themed stuff. So hopefully we do that. But yeah, I'm going to have a shower because I'm going to tan with ooh, the Dove gradual tan. Um, never tried it, but one of my friends tried it and said it was really good. So just to upkeep like a bit of a glory in winter, I don't want a full on tan unless I have something like big on. Um, so yeah. Let's do it. So we just finished dinner. Um, didn't take a video of it, sorry, but it wasn't that exciting. I mean, everything turned out amazing. Um, but Harry just went to go get some dessert. So I'll try and remember to show you that when it comes. Oh, I should probably straighten up this week. Got all of my um, candles are effed. This wick is like slanted as well, so come on just burns out like in two seconds but how cute is it 
Okay, <laughs> I just wanted to chuck in a bit of a review of the magic bra that I got sent. I'm just covering my nipples. Um, this one is called the Magic Seamless Full Support Wire Free Comfort Bra. Obviously, like wire free, super comfy, like not digging in. I'm just trying to cover my nipples. Um, I've got everything on the tiger setting as well, and like it still like fits pretty good. Uh, and I just really wanted something for like work, like a day to day stuff that wasn't gonna dig into me. Oh my god, I look naked. Um, <laughs> so yeah, this one's really comfy. It still feels really supportive, even though there's no wire, which is awesome, especially for us big chested girlies. I reckon that's something that is really key. Um, it's definitely something that I look for in the bras that I purchase. Like I don't purchase a lot of bras either because a lot of them just like suck. The shape's really flattering as well for me and my body type at least. Um, but yeah, it actually feels like you're wearing nothing, but also like that's what it looks like under my top. I know it's black, but um, yeah, it's super comfy and I'm really impressed. So they gave me a uh, discount code as well. It is Bianca20, all in caps. Uh, and I also have a personalized link, which I'll leave in the description box below as well. But yeah, thanks Magic Bra for sending me this product and I hope you guys go and check them out um, and use my discount code for a extra little discount. Morning. I have been awake since Harry left again, um, but I didn't get out of bed because we're going for a walk now um, to get a coffee. I literally just stayed in bed and read some more of my book. So yeah, I'm going to leave Harvey here for this morning we're taking him for a walk at lunchtime um just because it's too much taking him for a walk at the moment with like people like other people I really have to like train walk him still so it's just easier if I leave him here I'm back from my walk now <laughs> took off my puffer jacket um and I'm about to put some washing on surprise I actually have to take the washing off the line that I did on Wednesday because I forgot about it so that's fun um and then I'm gonna set up my laptop do some work, have some brekkie. Um, need to also wash my hair, but I'll do that after I take Harvey for a walk um, at around like lunchtime. So yeah, let's go. Look at this. Look, <gasps> excuse you. He's been obsessed with doing this lately. Hello, who's that? Who is it? Is that you? Ooh. Okay, I'm all showered, did my hair, everything's fine, did another layer of that dove. I don't know why I keep showing my hands and they literally look awful without like with all the missing nails. Um yeah. So yeah, dried my hair, put on some bronzing drops, um, and I feel so much better now. I love like doing my hair like this. Um, for some reason, my XL isn't working, which is awesome. Um, but only an hour to go with work, and I can chill out, read more of my book, which I'm actually like obsessed with at the moment. I think Harvey needs to go out. Yeah, I forgot what I was saying. Um, finish so I can read more of my book, potentially watch the latest episode of Kardashians because it came out last night. Um, and yeah, and then wait for Harry to get home. Okay, good morning. Well, official good morning. You saw me pulling our pre-workout this morning. Went to the gym this morning. Yesterday, I didn't take any footage either um, of like dinner or anything. Um, basically because we got to the place, um, the shopping center, and the was closed. And we were like, what the hell? <laughs> so um, we went to Sporting Globe. I got a chicken burger. It was like a... It came out with a charcoal bun. I was like, oh my god, amazing. It was like a buffalo chicken burger. It came with like an onion ring inside it, which was delish. Yeah, I always get like overwhelmed when plans like change because I'm like so like locked into what, which is probably bad. I'm locked into what I was like wanting and going there for. Um, 
So Google was closed, went to Sporting Globe, ate dinner, was so was so full, so we decided to go to Pancake Parlor after we shopped. So we shopped and then it was about like eight o'clock and then we went to Pancake Parlor. Um, and the guy goes, oh, we're not seeing people till like 8, 15, 8, 20. And I was like, what the hell? Like it wasn't even busy. Um, but yeah, so we're like, okay, don't worry about it. So we left. So we didn't get pancakes, which I was really upset about. Um, but it's fine. I think we might try and go Monday because we both have the day off because we're bringing Harvey to the vet. Yeah, it's Saturday today. I went to the gym quite early because I have brunch with a friend at 10. It's now 9. Um, I'm hoping to leave here by like 9.30. I wanted to go to Kmart too, and I'm also getting my nails done because, like, look at that, that's embarrassing. Um, <laughs> I wanted to go to Kmart too to get new towels because the ones that we've got are super scratchy. Like, of course, they're from Kmart, like, they're not going to be amazing. But um, we got like the wavy pink and like burgundy type of ones, and they have green ones of those, and they're really soft and like they wash pretty well. So, I'm going to get them too, I think. Um, if I don't get them today, I'll get them tomorrow. Got to come home after brunch and getting my nails done. Make a focaccia for tomorrow because we're going to my mum's house for lunch. And we're going to have steak sandwiches in like the focaccia bread that I'm going to make, which is exciting. Um, tonight we're going out with friends. Yeah. And then next week is kind of like a ride off for me because I've got three days off and then I'm working from home the other two days, which is good. Um, bit of a relief. Yeah, so I'm gonna get ready now. Um, hopefully I get ready in time. And yeah, I'm gonna just like retail my hair a bit on this side because it's a bit um, flat. And that's about it. So I'll check in when I'm ready. This is my outfit. Um, don't know if like everything goes together, but it's gonna do because I'm not changing. Also don't know if I'm gonna be freezing, but I'll be inside most of the time anyway. So yeah, I mean, I don't know. These like give me a bit of a cattle toe. But anyway. Um, yeah, obviously, knitters from Glassons, jeans of Princess Polly, and our gazelles, and then my bag is from Timu. So, that's the outfit today. I'm excited to go eat. We're gonna be the most awful angle ever, but I'm on my way back from brunch now. I said a little picky of what we ate we shared um which was lovely because i hate having to pick like one thing now i'm so full and i got my nails done i'll show you better when i'm at home but yeah so these glasses probably don't see me they're the only ones i have in my car so Hello and good morning. It is awesome. It's now Monday. I don't know if I mentioned in this vlog, but we're taking Harvey to get desexed today. So that's why I have like three days off and then working from home the rest of the week. Just, just so I can be here, obviously. Um, and yeah, I mean, how do I look? <laughs> I'm just about to like do something to my face. Um, Look a tiny bit more presentable. I don't think I'll really put on that much makeup. We are going to the pancake parlor after actually because of our whole ordeal at the pancake parlor on Friday. Because I still want to try those cinnamon roll pancakes. So we're going and my brother works there. So yeah. I'm getting ready. I'm pretty sure it's like freezing outside. Um, but that's fine. And then we're dropping Harvey off like basically as soon as the vet's open. Um, I think we're going to leave here in like half an hour. So, yeah. I think it might be a five star, guys. I'm looking a bit worse for wear, but it is Tuesday. Um, we got home with Harvey from the vet yesterday. It was a bit full on. I didn't really film anything. Um, so, yeah. Uh, little Harvey's in a cone. But he's doing actually like really well considering. Okay, checking in at the end of Tuesday because today has just been like up and down, really um testing. Haven't even had a shower. Hello, it's now Thursday and I've had the one of the worst weeks of my life. Um, it literally reminds me of when Harvey was a puppy. Like I'm obviously. It's probably one of the worst weeks of his life as well. Um, but oh my God, this has been so difficult. <sighs> like it's, I can't even describe. People that have gone through this probably know, but I think it's just been like a bit harder because he's literally 
over 30 kilos and that he's been jumping just a bit out of control because obviously he has heaps of energy um he's gonna start playing with a really loud toy right now but yeah i've just been like really struggling um but the only exciting thing that's happened to me in the past couple days is getting a package from elite 11 um they had their end of year end of financial year sales start yesterday um and i like quickly ordered stuff off the app and it came today which was amazing um i won't try it on all now because i'm in my dressing gown i'm planning to have a shower soon probably in my lunch break um so yeah this is the stuff that i got i got three things mainly because i've started back up at the gym again like trying to go consistently every week um at least twice a week um which is normally the weekends for me so I got another pair of leggings because at the moment all I have is like two black pairs which have been completely destroyed by Harvey's hair and like slobber no matter how much I try to clean them. Um, so I got this navy pair and the reviews were really good. These are the Seamless Elite 2 Seamless Leggings in Navy. And they've got like this really like thick waistband. Jeez, it doesn't seem very good. Um, a bit stretchy. And like I'm not a fan of like the lines and stuff on them, but it's fine. I got two tops. So I got a little like jacket. Because I used to have like a cropped quarter zip one that was similar to this. Um, but I didn't like how it was cropped. I really didn't like the quarter zip. So I just got like a long, it's kind of like similar to the Lululemon one. Um, and it's just a long sleeve, long little long sleeve jacket. Um, but yeah, I really wanted one of these because it's not like a full-on baggy jumper, but it also looks like it keeps you warm. So yeah, hopefully these all fit properly. And then I just got this hoodie. Hopefully it fits okay. I got it in a size small because every time I've ever gotten anything bigger than a size small and like a jumper, it's been too oversized. So hopefully that fits nice and it just looks like the Elite 11 um, right in there. I literally don't know what how am I gonna do this? Um, what the last thing I vlogged was. I think it was probably just me complaining about being at home with Harvey. But it's the next week now. Um, I did just go to the shops. I'm hoping this angle is gonna work. Well this height. Maybe I'll pop here on there. So I just went to the shops because I'm home looking after Harvey again. Harry actually stayed home with him majority of this week, um, but I'm like sick and I just took the day off anyway because I'm feeling a bit under the weather. Oh, and I also needed like new undies because I wear the seamless ones for work. Harvey's just chewing his cone right now and it's been happening like so often now and I literally don't know what to do. So, got my rice paper rolls. I got a garlic and prawn one and a barbecue chicken one. So I'm excited to have that. It's like 12 o'clock now. It's kind of timed it pretty well. Um, from Target, I got a few pairs of undies. So these were like, this brand was actually on sale, like $5 each. So I got three pairs of like little brief seamless undies of those. So there's two here. There's probably one. Oh no, there's three. And then I got this Lily Loves like G-string. So I thought I'd just try them out and see how they go. I wear them to the gym. So if these are good, then I know that. Oh, I should have got my 12. I got 10. Might be a bit uncomfy. But anyway, one of the main reasons I did go to Target was to get these PJs. Because I saw them on TikTok and they look amazing. Um, this girl said they're like kind of similar to Skims, but obviously not. Um, they're like this charcoal -y, like bluey type of colour. So the pants are like really long and wide. And then you've got the top that's like this, which is really cute. I got a size small because like it looks big. And I don't want them to be like too, too big, even though they are PJs. Um, but yeah, and the buttons are black, which are nice as well. Like a nice, are they black? I don't know. But yeah, so that's what they look like there. I'm going to have like a full... Hello. I'm gonna have a full everything shower um, today, which I'm excited about. And I'm gonna pop them on after. I got this reed diffuser because I saw someone on TikTok as well get it too. 
And I thought it would be good for our spare bathroom because we currently have um, a candle in there, which I just actually swapped out to the living room. Um, and so I never really like burn it because I'm too scared to um, leave the candle burning, right? Like, and then forget about it basically. So I got that. Um, and it's the same scent as the candle, which is cool. Just want to get it out of the packaging. Because it's literally so cute. So if you can hear that, he's trying to get the piece of the cone that he's chewed. Anyway. How cute. This is like, it was gingham as well, the little um, candle that I had in there. And then you just put them in there. I'll put it in properly later and yeah, figure that all out. I don't know why I just took it out of the box right now. Um, but anyway, oh, it's got a bit of a sticky thing on the bottom. So maybe I'll just put it back in there. Um, okay, and then from Kmart, I got this oil dispenser. Because at the moment I've got like the oil and salt and pepper on the tray. And I thought it would look cute. I mean, it doesn't even look bad, but like I thought it would look cuter with like a a transparent um, oil dispenser. So I got that. It was like $3.50. Um, that was from Kmart, if I didn't say. And then I got Harvey some pig ear strips because these are 100% pork. So stuff from Kmart obviously isn't like amazing um, in terms of like dog food, but I only get the things that are 100% like the protein. That they're meant to be and he loves them and then i got this kmart like everlast crew neck because all of mine are disgusting i actually have to go through the ones that i have because my um drawers can't close <laughs> so and i just know i have heaps of stuff that i could have like sold that i don't wear anymore and stuff like that so i actually that today and then from Kim's Warehouse, I just got mouthwash and some razors um, to pick this afternoon <laughs> to shave my legs and, you know, everything else. And that is it, I think. So, yeah, I'm going to have some lunch, go do some cleaning, and then um, have a shower. And, you know, hopefully this one chills out. I really want to read as well today, so I really want to make a priority to do that um, because I'm currently reading the second book in magnolia park and reading reading daisy hates um so like the second book and so is one of my best friends so that's really exciting she's finished it um and so i just want to be finished because she's like oh my god it's so good and i like just want to be there this is the everlast jumper on from kmart um i love the contrast of the cream and the brown that's like why i got it there was another one that I wanted to get and it was like a hoodie and it was like a slate color, but I was like, that's enough. So yeah, I just washed my makeup brushes um, and now I'm going to have a shower, do my skincare and everything. And finally he is sleepy and I'm going to put this on charge because it's currently flashing. So I'll catch you later. I am now out of the shower in my new PJ. Harvey's still acting like a sad I made my new PJs, um, but yeah, did like whole skincare, wash my hair. Um, I'm gonna try and relax now with this freaking demon um, and read some of my book finally because it's already three o'clock and I literally like haven't even sat down to relax. So, hello and good morning. Um, it is Friday and I am just about to log into work. Feels like deja vu every time I start on a Friday. Um, but I just went and walked with Danny and got a coffee. Um, I normally get small and I got a medium today, which, you know, I kind of needed the extra shot of coffee um, because Harry had to get up at like 3 a.m. this morning to go to work. So that was fun. Um, but yeah, it is actually not too cold today. It was like eight degrees or something when I was walking and I mean compared to like the past couple of Fridays it's been like one degree when we went for a walk and got coffee um but yeah so I mean hopefully last day with Harvey with the cone on because he's literally annihilated it and he can't scratch which is what you can hear right now it's literally his foot just banging on the cone the whole thing um his paws are okay I don't know if I mentioned it like he's a bit infected um, but we've been soaking that like we're meant to be and it looks like it's getting better. He can walk on it now, which is good. Like he's not limping anymore. Um, 
But yeah, I am really wanting to finish Daisy Hates today um, because I think I have like 40% left. And in my lunch break, I'm going to read it. Um, and then like after work, if I need to, I'm going to read it as well. So yeah, 30%. So I'm on 69%. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have some breakfast soon too. I've been really loving... Not the healthiest, but um, oats with like a Kinder in it, like a Kinder chocolate in it. Harry bought some Kinder chocolate, so I was like, I might as well just use some. Um, and it's elite, like Kinder just makes anything taste 10 times better. I also might make a focaccia for us for the weekend. Look at this kid. Look at this dog. Causing me stress. His wife got grey hairs, guys. I literally... Harry found some in my head and like pulled three out the other week. I was like, oh my God, that is depressing. But anyway, um, I'm going to log on, like I said, and oh my God, hold it, and um, get a day started. So let's go. Okay, it's time to make some breakfast. It is 8.57. I've got all my ingredients out here. So I, well, recently we've been using the uncle toby's like high protein vanilla oats but while i'm at home might as well just like use up these brown sugar and cinnamon sachets i have um so and plus they taste a bit nicer because i love brown sugar and cinnamon they're just a coles brand literally taste exactly the same as the uncle toby's version of these and they're like so much cheaper they're like three dollars thirty for i think they come like in a bigger pack as well anyway I've been using this so good high protein almond milk, which has actually been so good because um, yeah, it obviously has like a bit more protein in it. It has 10 grams of protein per serve. I don't use a full serve, so um, like in my oats at least. So I'm obviously not getting the whole like 10 grams of protein, um, but yeah, at least it's like a bit more protein that's been added into my oats. Just shake that up and then I just pour some and I always get this wrong the ratio hopefully that's fine then I'm going to add some protein powder this is the Masashi protein the plant protein in vanilla I'm not crazy about this taste but me and Harry brought it together so we've both been using it um it's okay it was on sale at Coles when we got it so yeah love um the macro mike vanilla buttercream i think it is and i also love the naked harvest one as well but i haven't gotten that in ages um i really have to like buy some protein that i actually like because it makes it like so much easier to use why are you making my leg um i also put some fiber in here because i know i don't get like enough fiber in my diet um this just helps keep everything regulated i mean some days i completely forget to use it but it's fine it's two teaspoons of that and you can't taste it which is amazing like it literally there's no um it's just like mixes into anything that you put it in so yeah i really like that one now i'm gonna mix this all up i might need a bit more milk I did put the protein powder in there. So we had takeaway on Wednesday because I literally came home and decided I didn't feel like cooking. And normally we have takeaway on a Friday, which is obviously today. So I've got on the menu some sweet potato Mexican bowls, which I used to make like all the time. It's literally just like roasting sweet potato um, and then like putting your mince mixture on top. So it's like a loaded potato bowl sour cream avocado um yeah anything that you'd usually put like in a burrito or whatever and i'm going to use turkey mince today because it is like a bit cheaper and it's like a bit i like personally like it a bit more than beef mince so i'm just going to put that in the microwave for a minute 30 and then we're going to chop up some strawberries which harvey will have some because he's waiting for it he's a smart little cookie he wants some 
Good boy. And I'm gonna like dice them because I don't like big chunks of strawberry. I like them to be diced. And that looks like enough strawberries to me. And I've got my Kinder and I also put golden syrup. So not the healthiest. I wouldn't say try this at home, but if you have a sweet tooth in the morning, definitely try this at home. Yeah, so let's just wait for this to be done. Lovely timing. We might need to add a bit more milk, but I'll just mix it. Yeah, let's add a tiny bit more. My nails keep chipping so easily. I don't know what's happening. Literally got these done like maybe a week and a half ago and this one like already had chipped that one and it's really annoying all right get your porridge to the consistency that you like it and that's what mine's looking like like not too runny but not too like hard and then i put my strawberries in there Lovely. If you can get something like this to store your store like your fruit and stuff in, especially strawberries, it keeps them really fresh. I literally got that from the reject shop, which was a surprise to me, but it's actually like lasted. And then I put the little kinder in, but I break it up and pop it all around the porridge. And I put some golden syrup on there. I used to be a really big like sugar-free maple syrup person, but surely like the sugar-free one can't be like great for you. Plus like you might as well just have the sugar if you don't have the sugar. And then that's what it looks like. A big bowl of sludge, but it tastes so good. And like the kinder melts and then you get like little bits of like sometimes unmelted kinder. But I like to wait till it's like all melted and I'm a big mixer, so I just mix everything in. Um, but then, yeah, let's go and sit down and eat. I'm going to put on some YouTube now because um, I caught up with a lot of my emails that I missed out on yesterday because like, I've been sick the whole week. I don't know if I mentioned that either. Um, but also, so I'm wanting to stay home and look after Harvey. So, yeah. Hello. <laughs> I just finished like kind of editing this video Hello? I didn't even know this had Siri. My laptop just like clicked at me and it was Siri. Anyway, um, yeah, I just wanted to pop on and end out this vlog because it's nearly like 40 minutes long. And um, I love long vlogs, but I don't know if everyone loves long vlogs. So I thought I'd just cut it off here. I don't really have anything else today to touch on um i'm literally just working from home so i might start up a vlog on the weekend because we're going to the footy which is really exciting it's the first time we're going to the footy this year and like the first time i've been to the footy in like two years maybe so that'll be fun and yeah i'll catch you guys in my next video